this is James Holder for IFL TV in association with Matt Cleans, Jim Marbella. I'm at the press conference today for Zolani, Tite vs Paul Butler. Also, we've gone from chief chief co event to chief support. Derry Matthews, how are you doing, Derry? I'm okay, mate. Um, you know, it's one of them things, boxing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Two and eight rounds, uh, get on with it. No more than just get in, do the job on Friday and then plan for the April 18th. As you know, in boxing, these things happen setbacks, whether it be on one side or another, it's all part of the game. How have you dealt with this setback? I've just, listen, I'm a professional, I've got to focus on, on Friday. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a true pro, and you know, it's, it's, it's part and parcel of boxing, and you know, it happens to the best of us in there, and you know, I'm just unfortunate it's happened to me. but. As my team have said to me, I'm still going to fight for the world title on April the 18th. The lads at MGM, Daniel and them, they, they told me it's going to happen, so it's going to happen. Mm -hmm. I mean, you've been very professional in the fact that you didn't pull out of this fight. I know you've done a hell of a lot of tickets, and you want really and truly you want to keep your, your people and people happy and keep yourself so you've at peak for your training camp. Yeah, not just that. As I stated before in the press conference, I want to be part of a great show. You know, Paul's going to make history. And you know, I want, I want to be there, I want to be a part of it and I want to get on early, sit, sit with my fans and my family and, and watch Paul win, win his second world title and you know, in, in the, most probably the best boxing city in the world. Mm. I mean, the opponent you've been in with, he, he's been in with some great guys, he's been in with Crawler. Are you worried having a world title shot four weeks away from this fight? Is that I'm, something that plays on your mind? I'm a professional and so, you know, I've, I've, got, to, I've got to take a professional and, you know, it's a, it's a great fight that... That I, that I want and you know I could have got any opponents but Danny my, train, my trainer picked this opponent by the way so you know a lot of credit to him as well and he said this is what he wants and, and this is what we've got so we've got it. So you arrive at the press conference today so low key you are Derry always low key just come in very quiet find your seat do your thing no drama. So I'm a quiet man I? I'm, just, listen, I'm a professional <laughs> I'm, I'm no, I respect everyone the same way. I want to be respected, and I'm a quiet kid who just loves fighting, loves boxing, and you know, I love the sport. I mean, it's so important for you Friday to come through this. And we know you mark up quite easily in sparring. So, does that dictate your tactics? I mean, will you be looking for a more complete I'm, I'm boxing gonna, performance? I'm just going to listen to Danny. Whatever he says, you know, what he says goes. So after the first round, I'll go back, and if he wants me to unload and let the big shots go, I'll go and let them go. But. I'm under instructions and it's just about getting the, the W on, on Friday, not losing a round, not getting a cut, not getting a mark and, and going from there. I've got to ask you this, how confident are you that Richard Abel will show 100%, if not, he's broke the contract, so I know, I know that he's, you know, he's, he's had a certain amount of money and certain stuff, so you know, the fight's happening, it's 100% happening, if not, he's, that's why we're fighting on April the 18th, because if not, the fight wouldn't have happened. No, he, he's broke the contract then, so he's got to fight me. Mm -hmm. Alright, well listen, we're very interested to see how this plays out. Um, thank you for talking to IFL TV and I look forward to the weigh-in tomorrow. Cheers, also you could have a little surprise, he could be here on Friday as well, so it'd be good for the, good for the five fans of Liverpool to see. I think it'd you know. be fantastic if he does come to build the fight with yourself. I think that's you know? what the, the time to, to get them over on Friday, hopefully. And, you know, we, we, the, the crowd can, you can see what he's about and, and let's see if he likes, likes a, you know, the reception he'll get. Well, I don't know if you was meant to tell me that, Mr Matthews, but I do appreciate it nonetheless. All right, cheers, mate. Thank you. Thank you, Derry. Thanks.